si Henergozo at paano ka nagsimula? Okay. Okay. Good day, chika. <laughs> Direct. Yeah. Mm. Yes. Oh, oh. Yes, I'm Hener Gozu from Peitai Rizal. My motto in life is not world peace, but to live beautifully in peace. Oh. Oh. Alam mo yan, ha? Alam mo yan, chika. Alam mo yan. Oo. Oh, oh. Alam mo yan. Ito ako pa ba? Nanood ka ba? Ako pa ba? Nanood ka ng binibili. Kailangan maganda tayo parate. Oh, yeah. That is why For the past decades, I've been creating fashion pieces that brings out the beauty, elegance, and prowess of all women na nadamitan na natin. Correct. Oh. Correct. Diba? Oh, huh? parang hindi, oh. Parang... Diba? Maganda, maganda. Direct oh, oh, yan. Diba? Pero, oh, oh, oh. Oh. Hindi, hindi siya scripted. Oh, oh. Ha? Hindi scripted. Hindi oh, oh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, you are considered as one of the most promising young designers of this generation. Can you give us a background of your of your career as a fashion designer? Thank you so much, Direk. Grabe. <laughs> um, okay. Uh, actually, Direk, um, medyo mahaba yung story. Pero uh, I actually started at a young age. Um, Mata pa lang ako. Uh, gusto ko na talaga maging designer. Um, I would dress up in a Barbie dolls and then I would ask my mom, my grandma to make uh, clothes for my Barbie dolls. But then, um, they were super busy. So, ako na lang yung gumawa. Um, naalala ko na ako si mga pinag sa bahay kasi na ginugot ko. So, mm-hmm. ayun. Um, my, gram- my grandma was a dress that she young. And then, my mom naman, she likes to make clothes na then talaga. Anong nararamdaman mo ngayon na uh, you are living the dream of a model in not only in New York kasi di ba nagpupunta ka rin ng Europa para mag-shoot minsan fini-feature ka sa Vietnam oh, sa Thailand anong nararamdaman mo ngayon na after 12 years you are living the dream of a model there I think after 12 years dun, dun ko lang po talaga na appreciate yung work ko kasi nung bata pa ako parang I don't know, parang very clueless, very, um, I guess, ma- minsan mas um, sad ako kasi away from the family. Nga, it's very kape. hard for me. Oo so, nga. parang very close ako sa family, mm-hmm. very attached. Mm-hmm. So, parang mas nadadrawn ako sa pagiging sad. Kaya nakalimutan kong appreciate yung Blessings. Blessings, so... Yeah. So now that I'm older, every blessing, I'm so thankful. Na... It was your dream, no? To become a model. Yes. Diba? Pangarap mo na yun, bagets. Tsaka, gifted ka ng height. Sayang mm-hmm. na rin lang, diba? Tsaka, syempre, itsura. Diba? Uh-huh. Oh. Uh, sa, sa anong edad mo ba na, na pagtanto? Wow, ang lalim na pagtanto. <laughs> na pag naisip na pwede kang maging modelo. Mga ilang taon ka, no? Kwento mo. Ano po, ever since talaga. Simula My, nung uh, siguro 8 po. Ah, talaga? As early as 8? Mm-hmm. Ah? As early nung as 8. grade 1 pa lang po ako. Kasi ako na yung pinaka, ano, pinakadulo sa pila. Oo, oh, 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 nasa lagi nasa likod. Ayun, sabi ko, sign. Siguro mga sign yun okay. na matangkad talaga ako. And then, nagulat na lang ako nung ano na yung taon, mas lalo akong tumangkad. Oh, okay. And other people na told me na, ay, can you become a model? Parang, sinasabihan ka na nila. Oo, oh, sinasabihan okay. nila. Sabi ko, Ko, ano ba yung model? So, na-curious ako. Tapos, nag-research ako about doon. And then, nakita ko, gusto ko nga. Ah, so, gusto... eight years old pa lang, mm-hmm, ha? Yes. Remember, kids, sa eight years old pa lang, na-realize niya na, na pwede pala siya maging mm-hmm. model. Kim, natanong lang kita. Siyempre, may pumupuri. Ah, Meron ding mga hindi natutuwa, no? Sa mga, ah, okay. uh, sa mga na-make-upan mo, nagawa mo ng buho. Uh, paano natatapos yung ganyang sitwasyon na hindi satisfied? Paano mo tinatapos? Paano mo tinatakel yung ganong klaseng sitwasyon? Actually, Derek, ano, meron po talaga, kahit sabihin mo na sobrang tagal mo na sa industry, at kahit sabihin mo sa sarili mo na marunong ka na, mayroon kasi sabihin magaling na magaling, kasi hindi naman po lahat talaga. Kahit sabihin natin gustong gusto ka, 
meron hmm. iba dyan na hindi magugustuhan ng gawa mo kahit ginawa oh, mo na ito. Oh, oh. Paano mo pinatakil yun? Pag sa akin kasi ganun direct, kung ano po yung, basta yung sa akin po, ibibigay ko yung 100% ko, dun hmm. po sa, sa mga, let's say, sa, sa mga major nilang gustong pagawa sa akin, gaya sa buhok, sa makeup, hmm. binibigay ko yung 100% ko hanggang sa, nasa kanila na po yun kung hindi nila ma-appreciate. Pero basta hanggat maaari, direct, bibigay ko po ng 100%. May, may natatandaan ka pa ba sa mga unang shows na ginawa mo? I, I'm sure nakalimutan mo na iba kasi tagal na noon. Pero kung may natatandaan ka, ano yung masasabi mo tungkol dun sa show na yun? Bakit memorable? Ang unang show ko, hindi ko na matandaan exactly kung ano siya. Pero after ng body shots ito, hindi na ako nakauwi. I remember it kasi pumunta sila mama and then gusto nila akong isama nila mama noon dun sa dun sa ano sa Ilocos muna. Sabi ko hindi pwede kasi may mga shows na may mga shows, may lineup na ng shows after ng body shots dito noon. So, hindi ko na talaga hindi ko na maano yung basta sunod-sunod na yon. Pero naaalala ko yung mga first shows ko sa NBC 10 kung natatanda mo. Ano? Oo, gay la yun eh, na madaming ah, designers. Hindi ko nang matandaan kung anong show yun. Fashion Week. Hindi ba Fashion Week? Oo, oh, hindi Fashion Week dito. Kasi ang Fashion Week nun is sa Glorieta. NBC, at saka NBC 10. Ito on. She's in New York now. Uh, she's going to be based there already. Uh, before, she she modeled here in the Philippines. And she worked also in Macau. So I'd like everyone to know more about her. Yung mga pinagdaanan niya. Although, my audience know very well that my interviews are always positive. Um, I don't want to delve on the negative side of everything, but I just want people to learn about your life, Natasha, and be an, a good example to the young ones. Kasi nga, yun ang audience ko. Yes. Well, really, thank you so much for inviting me, Derek. It's such an honor. You know, we used to work a couple, year, couple of years back, and you know getting a, a message from you to interview me is really you know very um na ano ako na inspire ako so ko wow oh my god direct kata remembers me so i'm really excited for today topic that the design but specialize in menswear um did any design inspire you no. so uh actually when i started at sm uh I started as an interior designer actually in Sumar. And then eventually the interior designer. The store layouts from then on. Okay. In, that was in 1981. So it's all store layouts. And then from there, I went to display. And then from display, Sigur my boss found na I was not in fashion. So the display that is. Display na prefer for short while I speak and it's a short speak now we edit. Became a merchandiser, junior merchandiser, ng menswear for the boutique square. Iba, the boutique square is a, yes, a, a Makati yeah. store within a store. Iba, with designer labels, local ready to wear. There's another floor, another setting area for the boutique square, mga designer brands. And then from there, uh, I was then asked to the, develop the local, the in-house brands, SM, Newsmakers and Men's Club, mga t-shirts and polo shirts. From there, doon nagsimula ang aking... Uh, ano ka ba napunta sa modeling? Sa modeling? Well, nag-start ako, syempre, here in my hometown sa Pampanga. I started doing shows for a local designer. Mm-hmm. And then, I was discovered by you. <laughs> Oy, teka mo. Teka mo na, teka mo na. Pangalanan mo naman yung local designer. Ano ka ba? I- Yes, I was discovered. I, I was I started doing shows for Philip Torres. Um he's a very known um designer here in Pampanga and then ayun um I met you at his shop because lagi ka tam <laughs> lagi ka madalas in Pampanga. Madaming magaganda at guapo here. <laughs> and then oh, um <laughs> ayun that's actually what really thrusted me into the modeling scene in Manila because you sent me to castings there. So, syempre, dun lahat ng mga fashion week, all mm. the, like, big shows and, like, photo shoots. So, yeah, that's pretty much how I started. Part of body shots mo, search, no? And, ayoko na sabihin yung tao, nakakaedan. <laughs> <laughs> diba? 
Tapos, uh, alam mo, Kati, nung time na yun, anti-commercial model ka na eh. Diba? Marami ka nang ginagawa nun eh. Print. Print, diba? I mean, some commercials, meron na rin, diba? So, bakit nag-decide ka pa rin sumali sa Bani siya? So, I remember that time eh, na alam ko, ano ka na eh, sa commercial tsaka sa mga prints. Bakit? Eh? Oo, oh, <laughs> bakit ka pa rin sumali? Um, kasi back then, uh, I don't have more Body shots have been like there or here forever. Like, long, long time ago, since the age show. Um, I believe uh, this group will or can teach me how to walk properly. Because you want to Yes. Ito. And I've been doing this for a long time. I don't have to have a show. But, so, I decided to